morning, good morning, good morning. Hope you're all having a fantastic day. Welcome back to another Wombat Beginner Guide where we're going to talk about sidekicks because they just got an upgrade. So we're not just talking about level upgrades. We're talking about there's more sidekicks available and the ones that you actually have really help towards your mining power. And we'll talk about that here shortly. But let me quick t talk to you about the new sidekicks that are available. They just dropped recently. You can go ahead and grab them on Nefty. I'm sure they'll be available on the secondary market soon. You can go ahead and grab one of the packs, which is a random, uh, basically a random selection of the new ones, or you can go through and grab an individual one. And you can see there, I believe there's 10 total new ones. So you can see if there's any that really boost the collections that you have. They're out there on the secondary market. If you have VIP, you're going to go ahead and get a 223 wax discount. Um, so another reason to go ahead and get the, the VIP, um, plus all the other benefits, which we've talked about in another video. And I've also done a full other video on how to use sidekicks. I just thought this was pretty critical as far as uh, the boost that they've done for the upgrade. So if you're not aware, you can go ahead and actually put two sidekicks in there. I have one in there that needs to get upgraded. I got to get in one of the power bars. Uh, and then there's a second sidekick that you can open up with a little bit of Wombat tokens. I have not done that yet, but I am going to very shortly. Uh, but it's nice because you get two in there. They get to boost two different uh, two different collections and give you extra mining power for about the same amount. You just got to level them up by running different missions. Uh, but they have a bunch of new ones out. My favorite new one is the one all the way at the top here, which is the Nugget for uh, Dungeon Golds. Uh, there's also a few other notable ones. Uh, down here we got the Crew Tunes uh, for Wax, which is a cool one. Uh, and I, all of these are great. I'm these just calling out the ones that, that, that I may use here in the near future. Um, so there's definitely some new ones out there. Again, you can go ahead and just grab a pack and then uh, cross your fingers and hope it matches something that you have, uh, with even just 18,000, 19,000 Wombat. It's nice when they go ahead and do that. But the thing I really wanted to highlight in this video is the upgrade that sidekicks have taken. Normally what sidekicks do is they go ahead and they boost whatever collection is connected to it. For example, the one that I have here, uh, it boosts towards um, the, the champions, the Wombat champions, uh, and those that I have staked within my, my, my game. Uh, so it's essentially you start with 20%. Uh, boost just for staking it in there and every level you go up it adds to it all the way up to I believe it's 50% of a boost for the mining power. The other thing that they've added and this was just added recently is now your sidekick also gives you mining power. You Not just for the collection that you hold but your sidekick itself and as you upgrade or level up your sidekick that boost also happens. Uh, which is very nice and can get very good, especially if you have two staked that are climbing up the levels and get as, uh, to level 30. Um, essentially what it is for every single level, it's 100 mining power. So if you only have one level one or two level ones, it's only a couple hundred. But once you get them leveled up to level 30, that is 3,000 if you have one, that is 6,000 if you have two. And that is a major jump for those of you that are trying to get to that 50,000 mark of MP. It's a huge jump. And all you have to do is have it staked and just level it up every single time. You do need the, if I jump back over here, you will need a power bar every single level that it goes up. And I, yeah, these, these power bars right here, which are 1000 Wombat, uh, depending on what you have, it, it might be a little tough to get those every single time. I, I get it because not everyone has a constant flow of Wombat token coming in, but it's an option there that you can go ahead and craft. And then every single time you do that level, uh, you can go ahead and upgrade them and now you get an, for every upgrade you get one percentage towards a collection for the mining bonus and also you get 100 extra MP from your actual sidekick itself. So it makes sense to go ahead and try and boost these up to 30 if you can level 30 and also please 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 make sure you're very focused on the ones that you select. Don't just select ones because they got them out of a random or they're the cheapest. Select ones that actually have good counterparts. Like I said, the Wombat Champion one that I have, 
uh, is, is probably one of my favorite. I'm curious to see how it's going to work out with the new Dungeon Worlds and actually using these as senseis. We'll see what happens there. But there's also some other good ones. Some people are focused on the gold, so the, the nugget would work well. I know this is a very popular collection, and there's a ton of other collections that are available in the secondary market. This that we see on the Neft, on Nefty right now for the drop is just the new ones. There's a whole selection of other ones that you can get on the secondary market. So if you are at all in Dungeon Worlds or Dungeon Masters, either one, uh, and you haven't considered a sidekick yet, I would highly encourage you to take a look at sidekicks if they match any of the collections that you're focused on because now you have extra bonuses to it. I hope this was helpful. Go ahead in the comments down below. Let me know if you have any questions. Also, let me know if you have any sidekicks. Which sidekicks do you have? I hope you all have a great day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye. <music>